Yeah, so there's so certainly patience is, is is a good one to pick out, right? Because your sales cycles inherently are longer. However, the the other two that I'd call out is relationship focused, right? Which ironically isn't particularly my strength. Um, but having someone who enjoys the process of networking is really critical to sort of long-term success. And the other one is commercial awareness, right? So one of the things that made me really like push my career on, especially in the, in the early part is I wasn't interested in selling product. I was interested in building business plans. And so I went into sort of MDs and said, let me understand your business. Let me understand where your three-year growth plan comes from. What technology stacks? What's your IP, uh, ideal uh, customer profile? How are you accessing that? And then can I fit into that in any way? And had a very much open discussion. Um, but you can imagine the difference between that conversation and can I please talk to you about the features and benefits of this product that I really, really like? It's That's just not an interesting conversation. Whereas the one I'm having, they can see I'm really trying to understand how do we win together and people love talking about their own businesses so you know, yeah they wel <laughs> welcome me in all the time and that was the thing that allowed me to be hyper aggressive because i think maybe if you know personally for me building relationships wasn't something that you know is at the forefront of what i wanted to achieve but i wanted to make sure that i was making a load of money and that my partners were making a load of money and for the more commercially savvy partners out there that resonated really well